Hey guys, I'm Alan Zirkel with Mr. Z's Music Lessons, and today we'll be doing a piano tutorial over Living Hope by Phil Wickham. And if you'll check in the description of the video, you'll find a link to a cover video of me playing and singing through the whole thing if you want to hear what all the parts sound like together. Um, unfortunately, I don't have a chord chart for this song, um, at least one that I made, just because Ultimate Guitar, something's going on uh, with Ultimate Guitar and the, it's not working correctly. So um, I just have a praise charts link down there if you want to check that out, um, if you want to buy one. But All right, let's jump into the lesson. So we'll start off with the intro here, and we're just going to play octave E flats with the left hand. So And we'll hold it for four beats. We'll go one, two, three, four, and we're in the key of E flat. One, A flat, next, two, three, four, then E flat. One, two, three, four, back to A flat. One, that's it for the left hand. In the right hand, we'll be playing an E flat chord in second inversion. So we'll play B flat, E flat, and G all at the same time. Then we'll play E flat and G. In this little fill, we'll play B flat, E flat, B flat. So, so far, it'll sound like this. Then on praise charts, this next uh, chord is labeled as an A flat two. And we'll play B flat, E flat, and A flat. So we'll play those three together. E flat and B flat. Then the fill will go B flat, A flat, B flat. So for this A flat two chord, we'll have. Okay, then we're back to our E flat chord. We'll play the same thing we did the first time. Then on this last A flat two, we just won't play the fill in between. We'll go. And then just let it ring for the rest of the measure. So I'll go ahead and play the intro hands together for you. Sounds like this. And yeah, and that's it for the intro. And I watched the uh, music video of Phil Wickham playing this, and the pianist in that video, he's only playing like an E here, E flat here instead of the octave. But if you listen to it, like you can hear that lower octave in there. Um, so I don't know, maybe some studio magic or something. Uh, but that's what it sounds like to me. Then for verse one, we're going to switch between octaves and then just playing uh, the root by itself. And the verse is kind of lengthy, so I'm just going to play through it. And you can just watch my left hand to see when I play octaves and when it's just one note at a time. So we'll start out on octave E flats. And the uh, chords will be on the screen there for you to follow too. So we'll hold this E flat for four beats. One, two, three, four, then B flat. One, two. Four, A flat, octave stees, three, four, then B flat, one, two, three, four, then E flat, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, A flat for two beats, B flat for two beats, and then E flat for four, two, three, four, back to A flat, one, two, three, four, then octaves, one, two, three, four, E flat, or C minor, octaves, two, Four B flat for four beats. One, two, three, four. Back to E flat. One, two, three, four. B flat. One, two, three, four. A flat for two. One, two. B flat. Three, four. E flat for four beats. Three, four. Then A flat for four beats. And that'll take you all the way through verse one and also that little turnaround um, section that we'll go over. And then in the right hand, we're going to be playing inversions. And most of the time, we're just going to be playing two notes of the chord. Um, so for our E flat chord, we'll play G and B flat. And we're playing quarter notes. We'll go one, two, three, four. Then for B flat, we'll switch to F and B flat. And a rhythm will change. We'll have one, two, three, four. Then on our A flat chord, we'll play E flat, A flat, C. So in second inversion, we'll play that for two beats. One, two. For C minor, we'll play E flat, G, and B flat. Three, four, then back to our B flat, playing F and B flat. One, two, three, four. I'll just keep going. Back to A flat, then G and B flat. On beat four here, add an F. A flat, 
flat C, F and B flat. Then we'll have this fill that I'll go over with you. So we'll play G, G, F, G, B flat, C, C, B flat, C, B flat. Okay, and then I'll go ahead and go through the verse hands together for you. And sorry, I know that's kind of a long progression to remember. Uh, so starting on E flat octaves and then the right hand, G and B flat. to verse 2, which will play the same thing until the very end of verse 2. So I'm just going to play the last line of verse 2 where it says, Jesus Christ, my living hope. Um, we'll just go over this hands together. So we'll start out with the A flat in the left hand, and then the right hand will have E flat, A flat, and C. We'll just hold this for two beats, or play it for two beats. And then B flat, run. B flat, F, and B flat for two beats. And for our E flat chord, we'll go to an E flat and second inversion in the right hand. And we'll play that for three beats. One, two, three. Then right before it goes to the chorus, we'll switch to an E flat chord and reposition. So I'm going to play just the last line of verse two, where it says, Jesus Christ, my living hope. And to the root. So that's it for verse one and verse two. Then for the chorus, we'll be playing half notes here. We'll start out on A flat for two beats. We'll have one, two, E flat octave, three, four, B flat by itself, one, two, then C octave, three, four, same thing again. We'll do the same thing one more time. Then you'll have E flat, B flat. For the next course, we'll do the same thing there as well. Okay, and then in the right hand, uh, we're going to play an A flat chord and second inversion, and we're just going to play quarter notes all the way through here. So we'll hold this for two beats. We have one, two, and then for E flat, we'll have E flat G and B flat, three, four. Then for our B flat chord, we'll play it in first inversion, D F B flat for two beats, one, two. And for C minor, which is really C minor seven, we'll play E flat G and B flat. We'll do that same thing again. Same thing one more time. And then the last time we'll play A flat for two beats. Then we'll switch to E flat for one beat, B flat for one beat, then back to E flat quarter notes. Okay, let me play the whole chorus for you hands together. play the exact same thing again and then it'll go back to that fill the all right so that's it for the chorus and for verse three we'll play the same progression as verse one and verse two we're just going to move the right hand up a little bit higher and we're going to thin out our rhythm we'll play mostly whole notes the first time through uh, so i'm just going to go through this hands together just so you can hear it uh, so starting on an e flat chord our rhythm will change. We have one, two, three, four, A flat, C minor seven, come back to our B flat chord, two, three, four, that rhythm again, one, two, three, four, and here's where we'll play 
quarter notes on the second half. In the right hand. Because it's kind of building at this point. play verse 3. Then the final chorus has a tag of C minor at the end, so I do want to go ahead and play that for you. And on the cover video, I accidentally messed this part up, unfortunately. <laughs> um, but here's what it sounds like. guys i hope that that video really helps you learn this song uh, thanks so much for watching uh, let me know if you have any questions or anything in the comments have fun learning this one and i will see you in the next one